she's treating it like it's just another hat. The coronation viewers are shocked by the Queen's very casual approach to her crown, as Her Majesty pokes and prods the priceless piece. Viewers watching the Queen as she was reunited with her coronation crown, in a special program for the BBC last night were left aghast, after the monarch was seen casually rotating it, grabbing the ermine and even gently prodding a pearl. After a white-gloved aide put the historic 1661 crown, in front of the monarch, the 91-year-old wasted no time in getting to grips, literally, with it, leaving those watching at home shocked, at her relaxed approach to one of the country's most important artifacts. The hour-long show for BBC One, which celebrates 65 years since the Queen came to the throne, left some viewers suggesting that she was manhandling the crown, as she discussed wearing it just once, when she came to the throne, in 1953. When the unwieldy crown, one of two used in the coronation, is placed before her, the narrator reminds viewers that only three people in the world, the Queen herself, the Archbishop of Canterbury and the Crown Jeweler, can touch it without gloves on. Judging by the outpouring of reaction on social media, viewers were clearly expecting the Queen to have a more reverent approach to the crown, which boasts 440 precious and semi-precious stones. On Twitter, Charlie Proctor wrote, The nation gasps in horror, as the Queen manhandles the Queen jostles, with the crown hash the coronation. Another viewer, at Miss Ratchelou, added, watching the Queen manhandle the crown, which is what she does when she wants to wear it, after someone reverently picked it up with gloves for her was hilarious. At old Sparky Six added, loving seeing the Queen do away with protocol, and poke and prod the crown like it was just another hat. At Bugishu joked, can I ask that the crown is moved closer to the Queen? Queen grabs it, throws it across the table my crown, my rules. In a remarkably warm and chatty interview, the Queen also reveals how, during her coronation at Westminster Abbey, in 1953, her elaborate gown got stuck on the carpet pile, and for a moment she wasn't able to move. She is seen in the show at her sparkling best, relaxed and full of gems of information about the treasures that are hers to show off. The program was the fruit of a collaboration between the BBC and the Royal Collection Trust, guardian of more than a million antiques and works of art on behalf of the nation, which tells the stories of some of its greatest treasures, in a series of programs over the next few weeks. Unusually, to mark the 65th anniversary in June of her coronation, the Queen agreed to appear on camera at Buckingham Palace, with a selection of her crown jewels. The treasures were brought from the Tower of London to be filmed, as she reminisced with royal commentator Alice to Bruce. Faced with her diamond-encrusted imperial state crown, which she wore at the end of her coronation, and until recently used for most state openings of Parliament, the Queen has an almost comically hostile expression, as she unexpectedly pulls it towards her.